Hello guys, once again, two new quiz solutions for aerial robotic course for Coursera. It's week one and solution for 1.2. So let's move to the first questions. You observe the response of a system show in a figure. Okay, basically this is the figure we saw in the lecture as well. Like professor was mentioning that thing. So how you can control the oscillations? Uh, basically the logic behind that is a PID controller. You are going to use PID controller. Okay, so the decrease the proportions its gain and increase the derivation gain is the solutions. From this you can control the oscillations of a drone. And second one was basically you have to download the zip file which is there in the website once you download you can upload that in your matlab directory if you have matlab and i'll show you a demo as well now so once you uploaded that file in the matlab what you will do next you will gonna run the run sim command in the command line once you run that you will see the gui graphical user interface and then you just play with that because if you see there was a uh, quiz kind of things during the lecture to find out the kp value okay i'll not go into the detail but let me just open the matlab okay so once right now i'm in the matlab i uploaded that file when i run this command okay so it's open for me the gui you can see now the graphical user interface so basically this is the graphical user interface and the value of kp if i found 25 i calculated somehow and now i click on simulations so it's run successfully and it's giving value of kind of 12 so i put the value 12 and it gives me the correct solution so you can also put and the next the third one was the uh, like assume we are using the f 50 plus e tens plus four cells in the battery which uh, low which weight is 200 on board with laser 270 grams with the trust weight ratio of the platforms so basically what we are doing we are going to calculating uh, kind of uh, uh, grams i would say because they mentioned uh, expect for the trust weights and the propeller all unit are in grams so to calculate you have the solutions here i just put directly the computation part is ex uh, like it's take time so I don't want to extend the video a lot but if you need any help i'll post me in the comment i can give you solution and the fourth part was i i would say it very simple why don't all the rotors of the what rotor spin in the same direction that we saw also but if it starts spinning in the all rotor in the same direction it will cause robot constantly repo, uh, rotate that is the correct answer and the fifth question is like given the quad water consumes 200 watt of uh, the power to carry mass of 1 kg which components contribute more to the quarter quad rotator total power consumptions let's suppose we have 100 gram of computer to consume 40 watts of further operation or 200 laser which consume 20 watt for the operation so basically both contribute the same power for the consumption there is no other things so these are the correct answer and at last i would say thank you for watching and please share with your friends and please subscribe to my youtube channel thank you have a nice day and if it's weekend it's the rest of the day thank you very much